I'm going to show you how you can mirror your Samsung Galaxy S3 wirelessly to your HDTV. Now, first of all, this is a non-smart HDTV. Now, what is a smart TV? A smart TV is basically a TV that has integrated internet connectivity. So this TV here is a non-smart TV because I cannot connect to the internet uh, through solely from the TV itself. So because this is a non-smart TV, I need a device where I can link to my S3. And there's several different kind of devices, but the one I'm using here is a uh, ScreenBeam Mini 2. It's a Wi-Di receiver. Wi-Di stands for wireless display receiver. You simply put this on the back of your HDMI port. And I'll show you how that works and what it looks like in a second. But let's go ahead and hook it up. So here's my S3 and what you do is you just go to wireless or you go to screen mirroring. So what you do is I scroll down here and I click, I can click on this wrench right here. If I go to the wrench on the very bottom here, it says screen mirroring, or I can scroll down again in the top right hand corner, click on that icon. And then I can click on screen mirroring here as well, right here. So I'm gonna click that. Let's go ahead and link it. And this is great guys, cause you can watch uh, Netflix movies right off of your phone. Everything that's on your phone, it can be, um, it, it will display right onto your HDTV, okay? Uh, photos, videos, I mean, pretty much e even playing games. And I'll, I'll show you a game in a second, but excuse the display here. It's actually uh, my, my, I have a display issue. That's why it's like showing up green, but it shows fine on my HDTV. But let's see here. Let me go to a couple pictures here. And here's some pictures. Take a look at this. Oh, let me go. Let me go to screen rotation here. And this is my uh, old place in uh, Shanghai. Anyways, so that is some photos. Uh, let's go to. Let me, let's watch a video on YouTube. And we'll just go with this first video here, whatever this is. And of course the volume goes directly to my HDTV as well. So, that's a YouTube video. Okay, let me play a game on here really quick. Uh, let's go to this traffic racer here. Let me raise the volume. This uh, this little device in the back too, it it, uh, it does support uh, 1080p HD. 1080p HD. So let me just go ahead and show you what the device looks like. Okay, so basically this, this is what the device looks like. This plugs to into your uh, HDMI port, and then you have a, um, a a USB cable here. You need to click connect this USB cable because it's going to power this up. So if you have a USB cable in the back of your TV, uh, that's great. If, if not, you can plug it into a computer or anywhere where you have a USB port. Um, and even in the box itself, when you buy this device, it does come with a, uh, a wall outlet as well. So you can connect this right into the wall outlet if need be. Uh, also, it does come with a, um, an HDMI extender. Basically, you plug this uh, into your HDMI port, and then it's, an, it's just an extender because it's easier access. You know, so a lot of times, if you're trying to get in the back of your TV or HDMI, and it's like really hard to get to, with the extender, you simply just click, pop it in there once, and then you can use this. It gives you like a lot of leeway to plug other devices. So that's pretty much it. Uh, you can, if you guys have questions or anything, uh, just comment below. All right, thanks.